A reading from the Gospel of Luke. In those days, Mary set out and went with haste to a Judean town in the hill country, where she entered the house of Zechariah and greeted Elizabeth. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the child leaped in her womb, and Elizabeth was filled with the Holy Spirit and exclaimed with a loud cry, Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And why has this happened to me that the mother of my Lord comes to me? For as soon as I heard the sound of your greeting, the child in my womb leaped for joy. And blessed is she who believed that there would be a fulfillment of what was spoken to her by the Lord. And Mary said, My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked with favor on the lowliness of his servant. Surely from now on all generations will call me blessed. For the Mighty One has done great things for me, and holy is his name. His mercy is for those who fear him from generation to generation. He has shown strength with his arm. He has scattered the proud in the thoughts of their hearts. He has brought down the powerful from their thrones and lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and sent the rich away empty. He has helped his servant Israel in remembrance of his mercy, according to the promise he made to our ancestors, to Abraham and to his descendants forever. And Mary remained with her about three months and then returned to her home. Almighty Creator God, we are eternally grateful Mary said yes to you. That yes has changed the whole world. That yes did not come when things were as they should be. That yes came from a deep knowing that you care for those who feel forgotten, for those who have not been experiencing very much good news on this earth. Her trusting that deep knowing led to so much joy to everyone around her, including a baby in the womb. It led to singing and naming that you will feed the hungry and call to account those who have taken more than their share. This is good news for them too. Thank you for trusting yourself to a woman. We are thankful she let her body be broken and poured out for you so you could be broken and poured out for all of us. What a joy it is to live in friendship with you and all of humanity. In Christ's name we pray, amen.